Hi there. This is Quinn's, focusing on giving users informative solutions on unlocking any smart devices for legal use. The topic we are talking about today is Forgot iPhone Passcode How to Unlock. Now, 1 in 3 iPhone users will create a passcode to remain private and protect privacy like contacts, social media, browsing history, email, messages, bookmarks, online retail, etc. After setting a unique lock screen passcode, your iPhone will request your passcode to unlock it and access your data. But what happens if you forgot iPhone passcode? Yes, you'll be locked out of your iPhone if you don't set up Face ID or fingerprint, or you've set it up, but you restart the device. Besides, the screen will show you the iPhone unavailable or disabled message after you continuously enter too many passcodes incorrectly in the keypad. Now, we'll show you how to unlock an iPhone if you forgot the passcode. Maybe you recently changed the passcode on your iPhone and forgot it the next day. The solution here is to use Apple's feature to enter the previous passcode to unlock the phone. This is a way to unlock iPhone forgotten passcode without losing data. Perhaps you just can't can't remember iPhone passcode because you haven't used the device for a long time or tend to unlock with Face ID. In such cases, you'll have to reset the device to remove the passcode lock. Keep watching and we'll walk you through all the solutions step by step. If they work, make sure to subscribe to Quinn's and that will be a big support to us. Solution 1. Enter previous passcode. Here are the requirements. The passcode you forgot is changed within 72 hours. Your iPhone is running iOS 17 or later versions. You know the old passcode. Here are the steps. Make sure you've entered the wrong passcode more than 5 times and you see the unavailable screen. Then, from the bottom right corner of the screen, tap Forgot Passcode. Tap Enter Previous Passcode. Enter your old passcode, then follow the on-screen instructions to set a new passcode. Now, feel free to enter the device and access your data. Solution 2. Use Passcode Reset Feature. Here are the requirements. Your iPhone is running iOS 17 or later versions. Your iPhone is connected to a stable Wi-Fi or cellular network. You have the Apple ID and password that's signed in with the locked iPhone. Find My feature is enabled before you forget the passcode. Here are the steps. Make sure you've entered the wrong passcode more than 5 times and you see the unavailable screen. Then, from the bottom right corner of the screen, tap Forgot Passcode. On the security lock screen, tap Start iPhone Reset. Enter your Apple ID password to sign out of Apple ID on your device. Tap Erase iPhone to permanently delete all your data and settings. When the device restarts and you see the Hello screen, it means that you managed to remove the forgotten iPhone passcode. Now, follow the on-screen instructions to reset your device, restore your data and settings from backup, and set a new device password. Solution 3. Use Apple Devices app. Here are the requirements. Your locked iPhone has been connected with the Apple Devices app in this Windows or Mac computer recently. Here are the steps. Plug your iPhone into a PC or a Mac using Apple M5 certified cables. Double-click the Apple Devices app to run it. Your iPhone should be detected automatically if you've used the app before. If you are using a PC, select the General tab in the left sidebar. If you are using a Mac, select your iPhone that appears on the left sidebar. In the next screen, choose the Restore iPhone button and follow the on-screen instructions. It'll then trigger the reset process and wipe clean the data along with the passcode you forgot on your iPhone. It might take a few hours for the reset and new iOS firmware download. Once done, your iPhone will boot up to the Hello screen. You can choose to set it up as a new device, restore data from a current backup on iCloud or computer, or transfer data from an iPhone or Android phone. Solution 4. Use iCloud's Find My iPhone feature. Here are the requirements. Find My feature is enabled before you forgot iPhone lock passcode. Your iPhone is connected to a stable Wi-Fi or cellular network. You have the Apple ID and password that's signed in with the locked iPhone. Here are the steps. Open a browser on a computer or a tablet and go to iCloud.com. Then, sign in iCloud with your Apple ID and password. Once logged in, choose the Find iPhone icon from the page. From the top middle of the web page, click your device name. You'll see a list of iOS devices that signed in with the same Apple ID with your locked iPhone. Now, select the device that you can't remember the passcode for and want to unlock. Next, choose the Erase iPhone option, and then select the Erase option to confirm. As long as your iPhone is connected to a stable network, it'll be erased quickly. 
Once done, your iPhone will boot up to the Hello screen. You can choose to set it up as a new device, restore data from a current backup on iCloud or computer, or transfer data from an iPhone or Android phone. Please note that using the Erase iPhone option will delete all data on your device, so make sure to back up any important information before proceeding with this step. Solution 5. Put iPhone into recovery mode. Here are the requirements. You have a Mac or a Windows computer with a stable network. You get iTunes or Finder software on the computer. The buttons work normally on your iPhone. Here are the steps. Prepare a Mac or a PC that your phone has connected before. Make sure you've downloaded iTunes or Finder and get it updated to its latest version. Then, turn off your iPhone. To turn off iPhone 8 or later models, press and hold both the side button and the volume down button until the power off slider appears. To turn off iPhone 7 or iPhone 6, press and hold the side button until the power off slider appears. To turn off iPhone SE or earlier models, press and hold the top button until the power off slider appears. Drag the slider to shut down the device, then wait a minute to make sure that it turns off completely. Next, let your iPhone enter recovery mode. Use an Apple M5 certified cable to connect your iPhone to the computer. Then, press some buttons to get into recovery mode. If you use iPhone 8 or later models, keep pressing the side button. If you use iPhone 7, keep pressing the volume down button. If you use iPhone 6S or earlier models, keep pressing the home button. Still keep pressing the button even when you see the Apple logo showing up. When you see the recovery mode, an image including a web link, a computer, and a cord. Then, go back to the iTunes or Finder screen and you should see the device has been detected. Besides, you should see a dialog box popping up letting you update or restore the phone. If you don't, you can click the phone in the sidebar to activate it. You can only choose the restore option and click restore and update. After you finish the on-screen instructions, your computer downloads software for your iPhone and begins the restore process. If the download takes more than 15 minutes and your device exits the recovery mode screen, let the download finish, then turn off your iPhone and start again. Wait for the process to finish. When the process finishes, your device will restart and show a setup screen. Disconnect your iPhone from the computer, then set up and use your iPhone. If you mistakenly let go of the button after the Apple logo appears and return back to the passcode screen again, just shut down your device and start over again. That's all for how to unlock iPhone with a forgotten passcode. If you have any questions about the problem, drop a comment below. If this video saves you out, tell us which method helps, and we'll appreciate that you can give this video a like and subscribe to Quinn's channel. See you in the next video.